There are two basic learning mechanisms that work when we train horses. One is classical conditioning and that's how the horse learns all of his voice aids or posture aids from the, from the uh, person who's leading or, or, um, or even riding the horse. And then there is also operant conditioning which is the use of reward based learning which can be either the pressure and the release of reins and legs or it can be the use of food rewards, any of the, either of those things. Now the use of voice is really important as a classically conditioned signal because the voice is a completely different modality to the use of any kind of pressure. So if there's any kind of lingering internalised memory of stress from pressure based signals then the voice is a brand new modality that can change that. So the way we would use this classical conditioning is very important. It's got to be the, the first thing that the horse hears. So therefore that would mean that if we want to teach the horse to step back we would say the word back and then ask him to go back. So we could go back and then apply the pressure or if we use the whip which is another uh, pressure based aid we could say back and maybe tap the leg and so the critical part is that the voice aid must come first in the train of things that he hears that's how it works it's classical conditioning or Pavlovian conditioning and it's all about predictability